Hi everybody. So I always start, isn't it, by saying hello, but isn't that really the polite thing to do? Is just to say hello to everyone? Anyway, I thought I'd just very brief little video because my mister here, Jesse, as you can see, he shed last night. It looks very Hi buddy, can I have this? As you can see, he is uh, sitting on it. Can I have it from under your bum, chum? I don't think he's gonna, gonna give it to me. I really don't want to disturb him because um, it's right around here. Goes up under him. Can I? Can Mum have it? I am disturbing you, aren't I? I'm so mean, but look at him. He's such a gorgeous looking boy. You know, I can't and uh, cannot say enough about carpet pythons. Um, you know, I've gotten, a, gotten, I have a Pani, a Maya, and um, Layla, who has yet to come home, but we're still waiting for that day but you know what can I say they are smart loving gentle gentle now Jessie's only a couple of years old but right from the word go you know I wasn't getting any um, defensive behavior no fight or flight from Jess whatsoever Whereas Tessa, you know, admittedly, I didn't get Jessie as an eight months old. Little interruption, but yes, I got, um, you know, Jessie much younger than I did Tessa. You know, Tessa is eight months old, different species. Uh, you know, she's a Bradley. Um, Jessie's a jungle. But you know, jungles are known to be quite defensive little little babies. But no, certainly not Jessie, and still isn't. As you can see, very chilled, very laid back. Um, you know, my hands here. He knows it's here. He's not worried about it. Um, I just want to get that shed, boy. But you're not parting with it, are you, today? But he just looks beautiful after his shed and in this lighting I guess you can't really see the true colours of him but still he is extremely um, yellow in between that black so carpet pythons if you haven't got one in your collection guys Go take a look. Go, go check them out. You will never regret getting one. Well, as you can see, I did get it out. A little bit torn up under the belly here, but it's all there. There's none on Jesse himself. But look at those patterns on this shed. And there's his little head. Well, hi everybody. I decided to get Jesse out a little bit later on. Just so that we can see him in all his glory, I guess. And yeah, just shed. So he's, he's certainly looking absolutely beautiful. Uh, belly and there's his bum and no Jesse's got a tight grip with his tail he's okay but he is he's looking um, beautiful and you know he wants to explore as they all do he's not a but um, you know still likes to feel steady and secure 
secure. That's Jesse though. But he's certainly growing guys. Like he's he's um, doing really really well. Nice clean shed. I'll let him secure himself on Noah. There's his little famous dot that he has on his back. The only one circle-ish dot that he actually has. And I've, I've actually seen it on um, some other jungles, that one dot down their back. So um, I don't know what's going on with Noah's face here. He is almost breaking my arm. Impossible. Him. hard. Possible. Now I'm trying to find where he is. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Right. Oh, it's just that he's, he's got a tight grip there and he's, he's making his way around here. You right? <laughs> yeah, Jesse always takes his time cruising around. Here he comes. He says, oh, I'm going to maybe go up high. Let's see if he, he wants to go up on your um on your shoulder. Hang on, we're getting there. Get in there. Let's see. You know, Jesse likes high. He he just likes to be up high. It is who Jesse is. So this new enclosure, I'm you know, he's gonna have that height that he can climb up and and hang out so because he does he puts his tail up and his head down or head up and tail down it just depends so but he's uh he's quite happy you know he feels quite secure and safe in that position so oh, i'm yep he's quite happy Cool. He's enjoying that, Noah. He likes to feel something securing pretty much every aspect of his body. Yeah. He's, uh... No, not, my, not near my chain, buddy. I don't want you to get pinched by it. It hurts. He's like, let me go up there. No. I know <laughs> what's up there. That's the hangout spot. You're not allowed. Hang on, just bring your arm back through the other way. Don't go, oh, okay. So there he is guys, out after his shed. So I'll slip this in with the video that I took of him in his enclosure. Jesse is coming up three, so and yes, he's a jungle carpet python, guys. Beautiful snakes. Certainly, you know, a very placid little fellow Jesse is. From the day he came home as one of those little kind of wiggly worms. Mm. Um, he was... Like a pony is. <laughs> ...in my hands and has uh, turned into a very very chilled out jungle carpet python. He takes his time. Um, not quite that active full on lily yet. That doesn't mean that he won't become that full on active um, boy. But uh, how you doing buddy? Great. <laughs> yes? I'm doing great mom. <laughs> Alright everybody. I'm gonna get Jesse back home as much as I'm sure he would continue to stay out but as soon as I open the doors and show him he can go home I'm pretty sure he'll head on home so um, yeah we'll just nice say <laughs> nice say ciao he's going all over the place Noah yeah I know he's your friend and I'm his 
sad. Huh. Okay. Bye. As you can see, he knows. He gets, you know, the rat's down here and he's up there and he's like, oh, I know what you're doing, Mum. So I will get a move on for him and you'll see his reaction with each little movement I make. He's certainly not um, a silly boy, this one, at all. So, we'll open up this door and I'll get his rat to him. Because he is definitely hungry after that shed. Aren't you, darling? There you go. So he's going to enjoy that meal. <laughs> Look at that little upturned nose that Jesse has. So he's looking, looking good. But he's only really got a couple of more small rats. He's going to be jumping up to the medium and he's ready for them. I'm only letting Jesse go every seven days. But once he hits those mediums, he'll be going every 10 days. And we're coming into winter, so he'll probably just slow down himself, not be so hungry. But we're still getting quite warm days at the moment, so. But for now, he's on a small rack. Ciao.